welcome, welcome, welcome to another funky, freaky, folkalistic Friday right here on your favorite entertainment show. It's E Request Live on ETV Ghana with your regular host, Abigail PIS. Abby B, my sign by view. Let me remind you that we are live on HD Plus on channel 114, so you can call, tell a friend to stick tuned with us, you know, stick and stay with us, because today is going to be a very, very interesting day. You know, Friday is there, everybody at the entertainment, she, 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 yeah, but we make sure so we set you in the party mood, just so your weekend is going to be lit and all that, so much, yeah, see, I, you're welcome, you're welcome. As I do all the time, I have a guest with me in the studios, but before I introduce my guest to you, I have an announcement to make. So to hap today happens to be, I mean, probably my last time that you're going to see me on e-request, because my time here is done. So yes, I have with me my beautiful lady in the studio who is going to be sitting in for me on the show. Um, from probably, I mean, when you with TV, so basically she's the one you're going to be seeing on air. So I just want to introduce her to you. Let's get to find out what she's bringing on the show. Oh, just come. I'll say you be be. You need to know whoever is going to be presenting your show for you. So you're going to get to know the ins and outs of this beautiful lady. And then from then, I am going to introduce you, my guest in the studios from today. And then we will continue with the conversation and your party and all that. So what you So I have with me. No, I should leave her to do her introduction. <laughs> yes. So I have with me my beautiful ladies in the studio. Hello, baby girl. Hi. <laughs> Hi, hi, you're hi, welcome, hi. you're welcome. Thank you. And you're so good at this. I'm sad myself that you're leaving. I know, right? I mean, I'll be coming, don't worry. Thank you. <laughs> See, I got you guys confirmation. She will be Oh, coming. Chanel, please introduce yourself to my viewers, what oh, your name is and what you do. I actually think they should be a bit familiar with me because you know that I was here for you yeah. during the ALN time. Exactly. But for those that may have missed it, hello, everybody. My name is LJ. Lindsay Joy, but I'm going to make it easier on you, LJ, and I'm going to be your partner, your companion. Joy, one minute, Joy, one minute, please. Can you move your hair a bit? Um, this uh, one? Yes, with the microphone. Mm, okay. okay, thank you Are very good? much. Good. I'm going to be your companion from now till whenever and doing exactly what she's been doing for you, but so much more because this time we're going to make it about you guys so much more. We're going to hear your requests, everything, every shout, love you want to show to anybody that's special to you. That's exactly what I'm trying to bring to the table. So yes, I'm ready for this. And no, no, no. And no, no, no. Bro, ni number set, no. So just know it's going to be fun. It's going to be entertaining. As you said, you're going to be this time around. You're going to interact with the people more. Um, what are they supposed to look out for when it comes to you? You know, what are you aside from they having to interact with you? What else are you bringing? Hey. I know myself to be the life of the party wherever I go to, okay? And I'm most definitely certain that if I'm here, you will know you're going to have a good time. Nice no matter one. what. Whenever, however. So all you have to do is make sure that you tune in so long as you want a good time. That's about it. That's beautiful. And you get to see her beautiful face as well, smile every day. <laughs> Ma making sure say your afternoons are bright and everything. The brightest. I know, right? <laughs> But before coming here, um, we know where you're working. So just give us a bit of background oh, of what you do. because they do not know. Exactly. Oh, okay. So this isn't my first rodeo when it comes to um, interacting with the public. I'm actually on YFM. I have a show that runs every Sunday morning that brings light and love and the presence of the Most High God into everybody's home nice. every Sunday morning, okay? And I'm thinking that, hey, that's not the only fit that you can be able to share mm. joy, which is my name. Mm. So, as I'm slipping in here, I'm trying to spread more of that. Nice. Not nice. just on Y, but also on E. So, that's beautiful. Mm -hmm. What's your show? What time does your show? Um, it is a Sunday morning, 5 a.m. through to 9 a.m. Nice know, it's never too early to be in the presence of the Lord. Hey, enjoy your presence of the Lord. <laughs> wow! I, I beg you, that is not <laughs> implying anything. No, it's not, it okay? <laughs> Make sure to tune in on YFM. L uh, listen to a beautiful voice. I mean, from 5 a.m. all the way through to 9 a.m. on yes. Sundays. Yes. And then from there, Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, you'll be seeing her every time in the afternoon on the set. Uh, 
I don't know. I still want to chat more with you, but I feel like our time is very limited. I feel like if we get into it, we'll never stop. Exactly. Truthfully. So let me take my first break. I'm still going to bring you in the studios before we end the show. But I think um, I'm going to introduce my guests mm -hmm. just so we have a little bit of chit chat. Yeah. And then when we're done, I bring you in. We open the phone lines. If you want to speak to her, she's going to be in the studio. So you talk to her and then get to vibe with her before we start with, you know, the relationship between you guys. So, Joy, thank you very much for coming. <laughs> Welcome back from the commercial break. Yes, this is e Request Live on ETV Ghana. Let me remind you again that we are live on um, HD Plus on channel 114. So before I went on a break, I gave you or I mentioned to you that I was going to have a guest in my studios. I'm sure you can see his picture on the screen. And probably you've seen the artwork everywhere. Yes, I won't waste more time, Carl. Like I'll just go straight into you. We <coughs> just said introduction. I'm going relax. So we have in the studios the one and only, the award winning, the superstar, the international fisherman, the one and only Gus Miller in the building. Mm -hmm. uh, my introduction, I'm going to say yes, my introduction. Yeah, dope, dope, dope. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. You're looking good. Thank you. You're looking amazing. Oh, so. Thank you. Thank you. And it will eat out the attitude. Bob. Let me start with this. I mean, yeah. it's been a while we heard from Gus Miller. I know. I mean, where have you been? We we'll miss uh, you. I've been working on. Eh? I've been working. I mean, sometimes you have to work on your own terms mm -hmm. and reinvent mm -hmm. and put things together mm -hmm. if you're not seeing things the way you want it to go. True. So what I did was just go into hibernation or hiding, and I started releasing music to, you know, a different kind of demography of exactly. people that love fresh vibes mm. so yeah I've, I've been working but dingly yeah. you know right now the hashtag or the the term be dingly dingly you know, yeah ding, just said ding, ding quiet you they do the job nice ding, one. not much nice no one. Nice, i like that yeah. how was your christmas anyways it's a new year i mean christmas <sighs> what chili okay. chili my christmas was amazing but it was all about work okay you know so before christmas i had um an amazing show at Alliance France called that Billy First. Mm -hmm. So we're all good. But we realized that we didn't have like something, you know, for December. We had just a charity event called Christmas in Jamestown mm -hmm. where we come, you know, we set up like a Christmas vibe in Jamestown for the kids. We eat and drink and a lot of that. And then we realized we needed to put something, you know, for my fans that can't make it to Jamestown. Mm -hmm. So we worked on a project called Buy a Dinner, mm -hmm. you know, January 3rd. So okay. the first Tuesday of the year, we had an event. So Beautiful. December was all about me running around, yeah, putting out billboards, like doing photo shoots, like making sure that the event was amazing. Mm. So yeah, my December was really hectic, but it pounded out well. Yeah. How yeah. did the event go? It went amazing, really, you know? Like, it was an intimate session with just like 300 of my fans. Okay. okay. And for me, I like intimate sessions because mm -hmm. then you get to, you know, have a connection, like build exactly. a stronger connection with your fan base. Exactly. So it was beautiful. We had it at um, Tilandi Tea Garden okay. in Laboni. Yeah. Nice, beautiful. And I'm sure your fans also appreciated it because they felt it wasn't like the majority. You it was just... At least, so you're having an intimate time with your superstar, and that yeah. feels good. I mean, yeah. to <laughs> Charlie, big ups, big you ups. Are, you are, no, we no, no. Up, we I want us to talk about 2023, what you're going to be doing. Mm. But before that, let's rewind it back, back, back. You are. People know Gas Miller. People know. I try to say cacao. Yeah. I try to say cacao. Say it, say it your own way. Don't worry. <laughs> it's allowed. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Ah. But let's take it back to those days, you yeah, know. Yeah. Before you became Gas Miller, before yeah. everybody got to know Gas Miller, who, 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 basically, who are you? I mean, growing up, which school did you go to? Um, when did you think, when did you see music and you knew that you wanted to really pursue music? Say, professional you want to do music let's uh, let's go through that journey with you from okay. your childhood okay so i i believe i've always been miller joseph mm -hmm. that is that is me and that part of me won't die mm -hmm. so as an artist i've always found a way to keep the brand that or my dream alive mm -hmm. my dream is gas miller 
Gasmela is what I spent my childhood trying to build. Like I kept telling my friends I'll be a big star. And most of them didn't believe me back then, you know. So I went to Institute of Divine Education. Okay. Um, it's called Shalom Shalom. It's one of the private schools at Collegon, a very big school. I mean, mm. people that know it. BBC. Know. Hey. <laughs> and from there, I bombed. I got, I got like 24 at my BEC. So, Don't worry, we are in the same league. So, so worry. I went to Mampon Presec, you know, and... Ha, hold on. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. It, it not be so. so, no, no, it's not, it's not even about even okay. the school. Like, my family, right? Mm. Like, we've been known in the community that we all go to Accra Academy. Okay. So, my, my big brother went, okay. and I'm supposed to go. My, my kid sister's um, kid just completed Accra Academy. Oh, so, okay. in the family, there, yeah, if you're okay. a cracker, you forgo. Okay. Or oh, you don't go to school. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. So, we couldn't make it to Accra Academy, okay. but we went to Mount Pompersec. Okay. And because I was determined then, um, I worked my way to get a transfer to um, Accra Academy. <laughs> but when I came, I mean, I was a bit late. Mrs. Okay. Loco gave out my spot. So she wrote a recommendation for me to go to Wesley Grammar. Okay. So I went into Wesley Grammar. From Wesley Grammar, I did IPS. I did accounting. And from there, I did not look back. I was like, it's music or nothing else. Because, I mean, back then, like I said, I used to look at my mirror and say, Charlie, you, this guy, you, there's greatness in you. Mm -hmm. And you can do amazing and exceedingly well if you put your mind to it. So I'm, after school, I'm like, I'm doing music full time and I've not looked back. But, I mean, if you wanted to do music, why didn't you study music but rather do accounting? Accounting is not the uncle. Oh, really? Yes, because you have to know how to manage your music. Money. I'm the first okay. artist ever in Ghana. Um, to invest into himself from the beginning to now. Hold on. So I came through the back door. I didn't come through the main main door. I can't say more. Yeah. Oto she da na. Yeah. Oh no. Mama mo be fa she da na na. Mama mama se ma. No one Steve. Okay. Yeah. So it's it's very important for you to know how to handle your money, to mm. keep your money, mm. to channel it right, not mm. overspend, mm. and also calculate wherever the money is going. Mm. So basically, that, that is what I've done from the beginning. I invested into myself. From my boda to I shot that video myself. Shout outs to okay. my mommy, wherever she did in the grave. But mm. she tried for me uh, for Aww. that video, you know. Um, so I've, I've been doing this like full time. So sometimes there are things that you will learn that will, maybe you I have a friend called Dr. Lelo. He's into medicine. He does music as well, okay. but he finds a way to, you know, pick the and they get some gigs from <laughs> the medicine side, yeah. you know, so yeah. it, works. it works. Yeah, it That's doesn't nice. matter what you do. Yeah, that's nice. And then you came out and then you became Gasmila, and your song was everywhere. And then in a year, wow. sir, me, I'm a tardy girl, that's what I'm saying. Saying, oh. kind of so back then in Takade, even though Katani and Tiba. What's the beat now? What you know? Mm. So only giddy giddy do addition. Yeah. Gang 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 gang. Yeah. <laughs> we knew Gas Miller. Yeah. I mean, you became like uh, the biggest artist in Ghana around yeah. that time. Yeah. How's the feeling like? You know. The feeling's amazing. It's like I told you so. You know, in your yeah. face. We did it. Yeah. <laughs> you know. So um, I came from a community where I had a lot of people doubt mm. my talent. Mm. And like I told you, um, my mom had a really giant mirror, mm -hmm. like at, inside her bedroom, at, like in front of her wardrobe. Mm -hmm. And that's where I go to stand and talk to, talk to myself, look myself in the mirror and bust them freestyles. Yeah. So whenever people say, oh, you, you're not a force, I've, I've already told myself I'm the best of the best. Good. You know, so for it to really come the into, mm -hmm. you know, actualization for everybody to see felt really good that, you know, Charlie, after all the skipping of wall and the cowboy in Charlie, we blew. <laughs> it's worth it. <laughs> yeah. It's worth it. Yeah. Nice. And then from then, you did a couple of things as well. Yeah. And then you went on break. It's just like you're saying. Yeah. You went into I hibernation. Didn't, I didn't go on break. So what this happened? is what happened. 2015, I had a bigger song ever. You know, the song was number one for nine months straight. And after that, somebody even did a remix to the song and the song also blew. So um, I was supposed to be nominated and awarded and I wasn't nominated or awarded for the record. So it just brought me back to understand that the whole music industry is like a Ponzi scheme. You know, they have us chasing, chasing a high. You know, you want a banger, you want a banger. So you release songs according to timelines mm -hmm. like Oh, Easter they come, make her drop mm -hmm. something for Easter. Oh, Bronya they come, make her drop something and get Christmas shows. Mm -hmm. So we didn't have time to create genuine fan base. Mm -hmm. You know, so I had to just go back and ask myself what 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 
gets me ticking. And I realized it's the, it's, the, it's the love for the music that I do. So what I did was I just went into the studio, locked myself up and started recording. And the songs that I recorded came out really beautifully, but it was so different and so unique. I felt that my fan base won't understand. Yeah. So what I did was I didn't even release it to the mainstream or put it on the Ghana motion and all of them. I just went straight to the streaming platform. So I was just putting my music on the streaming platforms and all of that. So I sort of build, I have like a cool stream numbers okay. when it comes to me. Okay. It's because I decided that I was going to work that lines and make sure I link up with people that are looking for fresh sounds okay. to invest in and that's mm -hmm. that's what i did so you know since you heard from me um i've had four to five projects already i dropped fisherman waves which had a can so machine and all of those mm -hmm. big songs i dropped um, underworld because whilst i was recording my projects i met artists that were really talented okay. but mainstream wasn't throwing lights on them okay. so i worked with them and those some of those artists are big now i'll mention names um, and then from the uh, the song, uh, the project um, Underworld, I did um, CSUN. CSUN talks about my life, you know. I, I mean, I was established at the time, but there were so many things that was that, that was going wrong. Like, mm -hmm. I had money, but I wasn't happy. Like, I, had, yeah. I was seeing the true friends or the real people yeah. around me, and I realized that most of them cannot come with me to where I'm going because mm -hmm. they don't see the vision the way I see it. So I just put a bit of myself into the project. Mm -hmm. From that project, I did 15th. I was born on the 15th of December. Okay. So I dropped a project called 15th. I put five songs on there because to every star, you have five edges. You know, so I dropped that project to in 2021. Okay. So last year, all I did was just drop singles. Nice. Let me take you back a bit. Mm. When you were thinking of, you know, changing or doing music according to how you wanted, yeah. weren't you scared at a point that you were going to lose your fan base? No. Because, okay. No. Because, you see, my fan base wasn't there. Do you know that I had to promote Abu Dhabi for over two years for it to blow? Okay. Because people didn't understand what is this? Why are you saying Who does that? You know, right? so people actually thought I was some cobola boy for mm. some side way, not knowing left and right, just they put on music. But that song is very, very deep. I was talking about women with disabilities and the fact that you shouldn't look at their disability but look at what they have in their hearts. Oh, did you know that? Yeah, so it's a very, very deep song, but people don't get it. And Buden Choshamono is your own life. Buden Choshamono, whatever you do with your life is you. If you fail, you can't blame me for making you fail. Feel, yeah. It is you, mm -hmm. so you have to make the best decisions for yourself. Mm -hmm. So it's a very deep song, but people didn't get it. I had to push it and push it and push it over two years before the song blew. Mm -hmm. So I understand that I am... Somebody will say ahead of your time. I okay. just think that I have like a different, I'm a visionary, so I see ahead, mm -hmm. you know. So I wasn't afraid. I just knew people would catch up with the time. If you listen to the um, Underworld project, people are now doing that kind of sound now. No. And I did it back then, 2018, 2019. Yeah. That about. You get what I'm saying? So I just decided, okay, since I am like this and God has created me to understand and grasp things differently, let me just do what God has called me to do. Mm -hmm. Just put out the music and I mean, they'll catch up. Nice. I like, <laughs> that. I like the mentality. I mean, yeah. sometimes people get scared to change. Change is a bit scary. Constant. That one day, change yeah. there will happen, whether you like it or not. So, I mean, we'll change and I say, fun. No, no, no. I'm fun, so actually. No, no, no. You're calling me. 2019, 2020, we were recording songs. We were in the COVID era. Yeah. How was that time for you like? Amazing. Amazing. Because I spent time with myself. So, I set up a creative agency um, between 20. 1920. So by 2020, we had worked for a year. We were living in the house. I had boys coming, Charlie, you know, paying salary and things. Mm -hmm. You know, be hey, boss. You, <laughs> have, you know, be joking. Chairman, chairman. But what happened with COVID is when COVID came, everybody had to go home. So now it was yeah. just left with me and myself and I and God. Mm. And I appreciate COVID so much because I got to understand who I am. Mm. COVID just gave me that pause to just go like, okay, now nothing to go on. What's mm -hmm. up? Yeah. You know, now you have to talk to yourself and know who you are. And, you know, I had time to ponder over a lot of things. Mm -hmm. So for me, that time was when I recorded the 
15 projects, okay. you know, okay. and it was recorded in my kitchen. Wow. Yeah, the whole project was recorded in my kitchen. So. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> it was beautiful, yeah. So you were in the kitchen and then it just came. You write yeah. your own songs, right? Yes, please. Okay. And I produced too. You produced too. Beats, yeah. Amazing. Yeah. So around that time, in the kitchen, how did it come? Oh, Charlie, me, the, uh, my sessions, they'll be different. We're not big big deal. See, so there was, I have a song called Do or Die. I might, I might, I might decide to drop it next year or this year. I don't, I don't know. Please drop it this year. This year, nothing else. <laughs> dropping it this year, my answer. So um, shout out to Zodiac. Uh, we brought a couple of friends. I have a friend from the UK who linked up Zodiac, like, oh, Charlie, we could go be in the house. So they came to my house, and then we set up in the kitchen, and then we started, like, they, they played a beat. And be, within five minutes, I'd made a hit song. So now they were like, ah, but if you can do a hit song within five minutes, why, why? don't you keep on releasing music? And the thing with me is, I see my music as my babies. Like, I, don't, I want to give them the best of the best. So it's not me. I don't feel if I put it out and it doesn't go the way it is. Anytime I hear it, I go like, I didn't do the best yeah. for, I didn't try for this song. Yeah. You, so I just want to take my time and put it out right. Mm. You know, but I mean, it's my recording sessions are always amazing. It's it's, it's fun. Nice. It's never it's never work for me. Nice. Yeah. And that's fifteen. So with the fifteen, um, is it like an EP or it's just like a single or? It's an EP. It's an EP. But yes. how many songs are there? Five songs on there. Like I told you, a, a star has five edges. Mm -hmm. And because I used my birth number, mm -hmm. I felt that the day I was born, a star was given onto this earth. The first song is called Untitled, which talks about my time in the industry and how my sound has not been given a chair. You know, I mean, we have hip life. We have high life. So you've created a Jenna. Yes, but Gatsmola created, Gatsmola brought his own wave and Jenna and style. And you can see with the dance, like movements now in Ghana, you can see that Charlie got smaller sport there mm -hmm. because them all be that zone to now, boss boss everybody. <laughs> so, so, for me, I feel that my sound, which I feel that it's about time we made it a genre that mm -hmm. is a zone to, mm -hmm. has not been given a tag. So, I named that song Untitled and it talks about okay. that song. And then I have a song on there called Shamakui. Shamakui, Shamakui, what are you doing? You say, I'm reading my money. Shamakwe, Shamakwe, what are you doing? I'm reading my money. Shamakwe, Shamakwe, what are you doing? I'm, I'm reading, reading my, my money. money. Shamakwe, Shamakwe, what are you doing? I'm, I'm reading, reading my, my money. money. <laughs> I'm reading my, my money. Choice, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so there's Shamakwe on there, and there's Obliteagu, okay. which is like, um, you know, a sad song for, for when people die and all okay. of that. And then we have Sa and Game Over featuring Luther. So okay. Luther was the only artist I put on the project because I see him like a brother, okay. you know, so I just put him on there. Nice. Yeah. And all these songs are on the streaming platform. Yes, like please. So people can go there and just stream it. Sharp, sharp, sharp. Do you sharp. have videos for it? I have vi I have a video for Untitled. Okay. Yes, okay. just Untitled. And it's out on YouTube, so people can yes, check please, it out. Yes, can, you can check it out. Okay, so go, go on YouTube right now. Take your phone right now. It's yeah. Check Gasmela Untitled. Untitled. Listen to the lyrics of the song, mm. and then, you know, vibe to it. Support a brother. And stream online as well. You buy yeah, yes, can, no. I buy it. Yeah. I'm reading my money. <laughs> and I can't make read the money well. I, say, Akasa, I, I have a playlist from you. I want yeah. us to play some songs, enjoy some music. Okay. We already did three points. From oh, you. okay. Um, it's a Papa. Yeah. Tell me about that song. Charlie, see, 2015, young man, I make money. Ah, I enter America. Because right now, ah, everybody talks about the cut videos of my hood. Mm -hmm. Nonsense videos. So, for Twitter, then they bash me. So, I just go to America. I go look, I go look for the directors when they shoot video for, I mean, Didi and Rick Ross and them. So, hey. so, I tell you, they want the money. What's up? <laughs> yes, block me. Yeah, block me. Yeah. Chairman, yeah. 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 What's up? Oh, they show me so they go take this money. Say, no problem. You know, I have, I have a point to prove, isn't it? Okay, <laughs> we can't shoot the video. So I paid them for three videos. We shot two of them. Wow. Right? I brought the two videos to Ghana. I dropped the first one. They jump, Papa. If you dare, we have to say Ghanaian saying, hey, don't follow them doing it. Sir. Just do you. See, they watch the video like, <laughs> when they tell you see that cartoon way, it, it, it come there, so, like they put it in skits. It go come, they can't watch what you do. They I don't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was what Ghanaians did to me. You know? Oh, and they tell you, they thing go me. We have spent money on the project too. To the, to the point that even the second video, I couldn't even release it. Because they thing go me. 
you know. I can't even control my see, dog. Camera, I say, I tell you, for only your money. Ghana, eh, don't see, don't mind them. When you when you they do your thing and then they talk, just do your thing, my guy. I beg, continue. They do your <laughs> thing and move. That's how come you don't jump, Papa. You jump, Papa. So if you watch the video, you see that like it was a different video. It was very, you know, dope and had dope girls. Hey. Oh, oh, Barry, zero. <laughs> zero, 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 and zero. And then right. we have, is it Keke? Yes, Keke. Keke. Yeah, so Keke, like I told you, I had a creative agency at the time and I was working with one guy called J2 Kool. So he was my editor. And Charlie, we were doing some amazing things. And Charlie, that record also came around the time we Azunto fracas day we then say Azunto that say ah, guess me like they alive. <laughs> my baby, how can my baby go die when I day alive and I give him for four every day? <laughs> <laughs> you know, so um, I did a video that just shows that um, you know Azunto is moving, it's growing, like it's moving through doors, it's breaking doors and opening doors mm. and breaking barriers. Mm. And even after we are dead and gone, it, it will still continue. True. Because high life is still here. Yeah. You know, but who, who created high life? Mm. Nobody knows. Mm. Nobody cares. But the creation would outlive the creator. Mm. You know, so if you watch the video, you see that it's just a movement. And at the end of the day, the, you have a frame where we are all in there, mm -hmm. my boys and dad. And That's the frame beautiful. still passes us and still goes on because mm -hmm. whatever we've created is not going to die. Yeah. I mean, Dance God Lloyd and Incredible Ziggy and all of them mm -hmm. are continuing taking the torch. Mm -hmm. there's, there's some even new girls and guys that are yeah. Stata and... Um, endurance and endurance, um, yeah. you know, mm -hmm. all of them. And for me, Charlie, the way they, they, they hold the touch, me, I get rough. Uh, Charlie, guys, it's <laughs> for the bless. Let's take a look at these videos and let me add one more tiny drum. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Charlie, happy belated birthday, Ali Chekankwe. Okay. You're a legend. I know that we, the guns, hold you high. Only means we now will kill our blue magic. Oh, Charlie, happy belated birthday to Tiny. Yesterday was his birthday. Okay, okay. So I'm like, okay, Charlie, let me just okay. drop one for him. Okay, you nice know. one. Of yeah. of blue magic. Open up my tears. Blue magic. Blue. I be you watch movies, right? Yeah. Yeah. Magic as in Obi and Hoya. Bluma, Bluma is the is a, I think antagonist. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, okay, so, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah your friend is tough. Tough. Uh, tough. Uh, the person we yeah, trust. Killer, with. Tough. Uh, killer. Like tough. Oh, okay, yeah. okay, okay. That be the blue man. We there. They call him blue man. Yeah. Let's check out these videos. We'll be right back. I'm still in the studio. A tiny right there with Jomo. Kassan but at least there are some side titles there, so at least you can read it and understand what he's trying to say. I hope you enjoyed it. But the second video, the, the, your video, now Ghana for name for you, Mono. Honestly. <laughs> See, it's beautiful. See, for that, please keep sorry, bringing it. Oh, yeah. yeah. Whatever you have in the box, ah, you are hiding. No, please bring it to us. And enjoy what you think. I totally agree. I think that you should give us a chance again. Yeah. Okay. Now, dear, we have experienced the first one. The first one was unexpected. Okay. Now we're ready. Now, dear, you're ready. Give yes. It okay. us. Okay. Give it to okay. us. You're well, ready. I'm gonna drop. Where are we? Shall you put give me some serious booking out to me? Come back. God, you see, I like that. They praise you one day, and then. I want to give me serious. If it's serious matter, like. <laughs> and they just moved on and after that i shot i can so much which was very local like which was what i i, I i'm like okay you know what make i give them something i think they want yeah and that's exactly I what oh they want everybody oh, oh applause <laughs> yes, yes. Hey, if this you want, you could die. I don't cause video again for you. Oh. Please bring the video out while you are no, way ahead yeah. of time. Yeah, we'll but I like too. your look as well with the Thank sakura. You. But now, you can yeah, the turban. Then so what? What's with the new look? So, like I told you, 2020 just gave me time to sit down and ask who I am, mm. and I realized that um, I'm royal, left and right, mom and dad. Okay. Um, apart from that, like I come from a long lineage of. Um, Prophets. So I come from Lante Oh, okay. And Lante um our clan is more or less like the priests of the. So when 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 you have like the king of Gamashi, mm. they come to our clan for us to pray for them. Okay. You know, okay. so all of those researches just taught me to just put this on. And I was also before then I was trying to have like a look that says Gan. Mm. You know, like there's so many tribes in Ghana, yes, but I mean, Ghans are really unique. Wow. So I wanted to like stand out from the rest when you see me, you know that, okay, many Ghans, 
Generally, you know, I yeah. think that the turban would relate more to the Hausa rather than Ga. Am I wrong? Okay, so do you know that the Gans actually came from the Nile all the way through Egypt to Nigeria and all of that? Absolutely. So we've actually left things. It's like me creating Azunto now. Tomorrow, people not, might not even remember that who Gasmela is, yeah. but they will, they will just move on to the sound. Nobody remembers who, who did High Life or mm. who did Jazz or whatever, but the creator goes away, but whatever they've created leaves on. Mm. You know, so you don't even know who started this mm. because we've actually gone through all of those places and left our identity and Max there mm. before we are here. Mm. So what is what and who is who got here first? Even if you listen to our languages, you realize that ah, they are similar. Sort of, yeah. You get what yeah. I'm saying? So media, I'm like, okay, you know what? This is me and it's beautiful. I've also realized that some gun boys are now also tying it. You know, so it's more like for me, it's the energy. I, I, when I feel something, I feel that I've been called to do it. Mm. So I do it and take the lead. I don't mind, like I said, I don't mind what people think. I know that with time, they will catch on and follow. Nice, that's beautiful. Yeah. So you've taken the lead with a video clip as well. Yes, <laughs> yes. So the, yes, 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 I was hold. Yes, you have to I bring, it out. Up, bring, bring it out. Bring it out. Bring it out. I draw, I draw the party. I mean, <laughs> We're in the studios and we have a joy and gas miller. Yes, um, you can call us right now if you want to speak to any of them. You can call us 0555-657278. The number again is 0555-657278. You're in the studios. Call in and let's vibe and let's chat. So 2023. Yes. What are we doing? What's happening for you? Um, what project are you working on? Okay. So from 2015, I've been working on a project called Fali Fali. Okay. So Fali Fali is just me um, as a gang boy. So like I told you, I went to a school called Institute of Divine Education, Shalom Shalom. It's very close to the beach. Okay. So when I stand like at or on the wall, I see you know people like just come and defecate around the coast and all mm -hmm. that. And I told myself, if I'm ever in a position of power, this is one thing I want to you change. Want to so when the money came. I'm like, okay, cool. What do I want to do as corporate social responsibility? And I'm like, let me clean the coast. Okay. So we kept cleaning for a while and realized that, oh, Charlie, the cleaning with the clean, yeah, check like, we tend the thing. Can you please hold on for a minute? Yeah. A minute. <laughs> I have my first caller now. Hello, caller. Hello. Good afternoon. Your name and where you're calling us from? I'm calling from Sotium. You're calling from Sotium. Okay, the name again. <laughs> the name again. Kashmo, Kashmo from Sotu. Kashmo in the building. Okay, okay. Gasmila is in the studios. Joy is in the studios. Do you have any Kasmila, messages for them? No more Ochi. Ochi, no more Montu and me. Fuck your Sotu. You're going to get to it. It's a market or no less. Ah, more of it. But I'm doing either of your. It's a market or no more. Okay, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what he said, but anyways, that was that was brilliant. He broke down the name so yeah. Okay. Into the, yeah, that was that was yeah, yeah. brilliant. You you you, brilliant. you you speak girl. I am girl, ma'am. Okay. Nashome is my name. Oh. Wow. Okay. Wow. Oh. 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 Hello. Okay, kindly do call us, Marcus. Still in the studios. <laughs> yeah. Hello, caller. Yeah, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Afternoon. Please, your name and where you're calling us from? Uh, my name is Richmond. I'm coming from Bobo Hello, Richmond from Bobo I know you are here for Gasmila, so please go ahead. Thank you. 
field for us to stand up and really talk to this chief because we have made them so they didn't need Yeah. And this kind of music that out there that is really influencing our youth in a mad way and the day they should trust in a way. All those things have to be worked for because we don't need it. Mm. So I feel you should keep up the good work. Thank and you. I feel like what we're thinking in the world of our staff. And that's a positive thing for the children of this country. Yes. So that's the only way that we need to move on in this life. That's so God bless him and God bless you all for making this program happen. Amen. Let's Thank you very see. much for tuning Let's in see. as well. That's Thank you for calling us. No way. Have a good day. No way. No way. Um, oh. I trust that you log off, but make you listen to Namono. I have a song called Namono, which speaks about Charlie, the way the land and things, the mm. way we now old men they do with the mm. bed. Right now, yeah, Charlie, we can try, mm. you know, sort mm. us out. Because mm. you see, I think they, we have two minutes to go. So oh. if we, I know, right? I'm running there, sir. You're starting and I'm there, so. Yeah. Let me up on it, offer, and then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, like, no more. Check out Namono. It talks about the same things that you're talking about now. Mm. Yeah. So you were asking me about Fale Fale 2023. Mm. So Fale Fale is there. Um, okay. We sort of changed the approach because we realized the drainage systems in Ghana go into the ocean. So that's the end bit of where the baller is. So all the baller you see at the seaside, don't be saying we will they do that, that thing. It be We've from the town, way. it be from in Thailand. Everybody, them are baller, they don't well dispose. Like the plastic rubber you just drop, it goes all the way there. So we decided to do more of the education. So for the past two years, we, we, we decided to work on kids mm. because train a child away should go and you can get yes. from it. So we've worked on kids for two years. We come into the community whenever it's time for more work. And then what we do is we ask them how we can together keep our community clean. And you'll be amazed with some of the answers that they, they, they come up with. That's so yeah, beautiful. we've been doing that. And there's, I believe, first also happening in October okay. and definitely buy your dinner in Charlie next year. Mm. Nice so we decide. Nice one. <laughs> A lot is going to be happening this yeah. year, 2023. Yeah. But don't forget, my main kind will keep streaming her songs on all the guitar platforms. platforms. Oh, yes, you can't catch Only me, she make her read my money. <laughs> Guys, why you leave me like that? <laughs> Tell her for trouble. Do you right? have, I mean, any social media handles that people can follow you on? Yes, yes. So, it's Gasmela wins on all platforms. Okay. You can say Mortal Kombat. If you win, <laughs> we don't say Luke wins. Quintana yeah. wins. So, me, my own, the Gasmela wins. Wins. Nice one. Yeah, on all platforms. Okay. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. TikTok, yeah. Snapchat. Uh, yeah, I think TikTok is Gasmela wins forever. Okay. And the forever is for and EVA. Okay, okay. Yes. But if you're going to check out your music, is that going to be the same name? No, my music is just Gasmela on Spotify, Deezer, mm. Apple Music. Uh, I'm not on Boomplay yet. Charlie Boomplay also. <laughs> Charlie Boomplay for link up and for talk. It uh, will happen. Yeah. It will happen. Yeah. It yeah. could be one of the highlights yeah. of the year. <laughs> nice yeah. one. I like that joy. Yeah. I think I'm having fun. Oh my no, God. it's, been, it's been actually marvelous listening to his story. This is beautiful. And I look forward to the great things that are happening this year. Guys, tune in every every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Catch me, okay? Yes, yes, we're doing a little handover, but we're going to keep the same energy, okay? So make sure you keep in touch and let's do this together. Thank you very much, guys. <laughs> no, you can be a real more you. Na corner. Oh. Oh, so yes, a quick birthday going out to Lexi the comic. Yesterday is your birthday. All the birthday blessings to you. I mean, in good health and long life. And anybody celebrating your birthdays today as well, quick happy birthday going out to you. My name is Abigail Apia. I brought you today's episode of E-Request. I'm done with you guys. Yes, I love you. But meet me anywhere. I mean, you can call me. You can Facebook me. You can Instagram me. At the Abigail Apia. Just send me a message. Let's get to talk. Let's get to vibe. And that's it. Do have a lovely day and a lovely weekend as well and enjoy the rest of our programs on ETV Ghana. Makramo and yet bye bye. <laughs>